Hello everyone, it's your best pal in the world, the best channel you guys have ever seen, PewDiePie. Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Kaz and welcome back to Sun on All the Memory Deep Frag! So, I can't do that long video because I stupidly forgot to charge my phone. So anyways, I was gonna make this video yesterday, but I got caught up doing stuff so I didn't upload. So I'm trying to, to redeem myself today. Anyways, so we got a new scout here, but the first step is 55 memory diamonds. And I do recommend you guys pull on it because it's like free, technically almost a free scout. 55 diamonds isn't a lot. So, it is the SAO game 5th anniversary skill vote scout. So, they're giving us a stray up and affiliate. Now, I did do the scout already, but I will go over them with you guys today. But, yeah, first step is 55 and then so on. Now, honestly, I think they increased the rate ups for this. And because from my Discord, apparently everyone has the characters. Like I said, Stray's SS3 looks like Yuna's. OS Yunus SS3, the first one, and Philia here looks like OS Silica's SS3. Now, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, let's go over here. So you see, I already did my scout, and I'll show you guys my results very soon. But let's go check them out real quick. Anyways, how are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good. You know, how how are the kids? How how are, are the how are the husbands? The the bays? The, the the cats? The dogs? How's the rash? Anyways, let's look at Straya's here. Her hers is called Cardinal Scale, just like the Cardinal System. That's pretty cool. Now, as you see, technically the same like Yunus. Now, you guys don't actually need to pull on this. Uh, if you got Straya, honestly, it's kind of a disappointment because you know. We can get OS Yuna and she does the same thing and she's non-element but uh yeah so she brings up uh defense I believe uh what else did she do MP as well so she's kind of she's pretty much the same but she's dark element so let's go to Philia and she is Dragon's Aqua Stream and she stole Pina <laughs> good job we don't need that lolly in our lives so it's the same she brings up attack and she also heals herself so what is this worth scouting for honestly uh if this was like another 125 memory diamonds i would say no because we've already had these characters or at least one of them that's very much free but uh philia here if you guys were actually in silica's birthday and you did her scout technically you could have gone that silica easily i feel like they increased the rate ups in birthday scouts so they're not really needed but it is only 55 memory diamonds on the first step so i would say at least do step one and but if you don't want to that's your choice you are saving 55 memory diamonds but i would just pull on this you know you get some nice characters why not anyways let me show you guys my results for that all right here we are with my scout so i had just about 50 memory diamonds to do step one and <laughs> The world! I can't tell if I have bad luck or if I have good luck of getting nothing. Alright, but this is on my other account, my free to play account. Will I get something here? And. <laughs> we actually got something here. I'm very, very happy. As you guys know, this is pre recorded, so fake reactions. Am I right? I'm pretty sure. Anyways. Let's look at what I got here. And they also have a different picture. It's not actually them. It's actually this nice picture. We got Philia, man. It feels good. Pat on the back, Tess. You should give yourself a pat on the back, too, because you guys believed in me that I could have gotten something, right? No? You guys are just mean to me. And we got two straight up. So it wasn't that big of a loss. I actually got both characters on one account. Not my main, my free to play. Amazing. Just amazing. Look at that picture beautiful but anyways that is not it we have something new to the notices added now if you guys don't know everything else is the same here but finally the, the event that we're quote unquote excited for are we as excited the second pvp event bullet of bullets they're giving this out way faster and as you can see there is yuki's weapon right there yes yuki's weapon 
this is our chance to get her weapon. So what's Bullet of Bullets? Bullet of Bullets that Kirito and Sinon fought in GGO is finally available. Time limited PvP where you compete with matched opponents. So improvements gets easier on BOB ranks. The balance between ranks and required crowns are reviewed and fixed. Improved hate system. This is something a lot of people have complained about. And if you guys don't know what the hate system is, it is when the boss is aggroed on you, aka when the boss is going towards you or going towards the other person. So apparently they improved it. At the boss battle stage, who will be targeted by the boss first will be based on the previous battle. Now I don't know it's like if you did well on the last battle, it'll go on the favor of the person that lost the last battle or the person that won. I'm pretty sure they're gonna go with the person that lost their battle because you know you know give them a chance. I could see them doing that, but that's just what I'm thinking. And anyways, improvements on parry. This is also something that was pretty much complained. Detection for parrying and network delay is improved. Now this is something that's kind of off because like we said, or you know. Like I've said before, it is kind of based on where you're at and who's hosting the game. So I don't think it's the network delay unless they're hosting the game and we're going towards that. At the same time, you still need the better connection if you want the parry to connect. And if you guys don't know, parry does improve your score on this. So, you know, I'm hoping for the best on this. I'll scam Bandai. Bandai. Okay, anyways, new fix chat. Now I'm sad. <laughs> Argo, I am the god, or whatever. Upgraded rewards, the amount of rewards you get at the end of a battle will be increased. Also, you get to obtain medallions with a fixed probability when you win a battle. Oh, the amount of BOB rank bonuses will be increased as well. That's very nice, I, I guess. But it's more of the gameplay that people are mad about. I don't think the rewards really matter unless you have better rewards equals a better life. And targeted player sign. A player who is targeted by a boss will be displayed with a yellow circle. Okay, so we'll actually know who they're aggroed on in the beginning of the game. And we could say, hey, this is rigged. Early on in the game. Okay, enjoy this PvP event, the second PvP event, bullet of bullets with these improvements. You know, last time they said this is something you have to be excited for. And I was like, those are some pretty strong- oh, crap. Those are some pretty strong words. But now look at them, they changed their wording. It's like, okay. But yeah, uh, good luck guys, <laughs> um, hopefully this will be a lot better than the last PvP event. There was a lot of complaints and there are a lot of things that they can't really do and it is understandable but at the same time it's really difficult to do this PvP event. So I, I can't blame them and it was our first one. So anyways, that's pretty much added to the notices. Now you may be wondering, Kaz, what are we doing today? Well, my good friend, buddy, old pal who have been watching my channel. By the way, uh, when I last see my subscriber count, we are eight subscribers away from 20,000. I am very happy and I just want to say again, thank you guys so much for 20,000 subscribers. And I have put on my community tab what I should do as a special for 20K because I do want to give back. I do want to do something fun that I can show you guys, you guys can enjoy, but I'm having a bit trouble of thinking what to do. And I did say I was going to like give away accounts, but honestly, I don't think I'll do a very good job at that. I want it to be something I can do as a video that you guys can enjoy, you guys can watch. And I got a lot of, I got some quest stuff, requests that are asking for the impossible. I mean, I understand where you're coming from, but come on. <laughs> It's impossible. Eat 20,000 Debbie cakes, if I remember? Tug 20,000 people? Where am I supposed to find 20,000 people? I mean, really, the more known ones that I could do is like Q&As, live stream something. It's like, what? I don't know. Let me know if you guys have any suggestions of what you'd like to see for my 20k subscriber special. Anyways, back to the game. So, yeah, so we still have all this stuff, but I will go through the ranking. I, I guess I didn't prove on this i haven't really tried yet so i got 47 seconds and 48 seconds and i did use the wrong character i didn't really mean to use yuki here but i will use her in my video today so i'm gonna show you guys how you can improve your score this is not like my actual good score that i'm gonna go with i am gonna try a bit harder to improve my score like i said like i have lost a little interest in the game so i'm not gonna try as hard as i usually would you know i at least i'm in top 10 usually i try to get up here i'm sure 
I can probably get like an even lower score, like 30 seconds or something, I don't know. But yeah, let's go over this. So first team here, I just have a bunch of wind characters that I'm going to use to fight the boss. And I did say, you should know that stun characters are good for the boss, but stun characters are mostly good on the second boss. So you would want to use at least two stunners on the second boss and then have a character, you know, for just fighting in general. So anyways, their stats, I don't have their equipment. These are just what they have now. I have not grinded their stuff yet, but I should eventually so you know, I can improve my score. That's part 1. Here is part 2 if you are all interested. I'm using Rain here cuz she stuns. Oh, whoops. I have Yuki here because she as well stuns and they're also very fast characters. And I have Austin here that I had before that I level 100 because she is actually very helpful. Anyways, let's see if I can do this and if I remember everything. Now, like I said, I can't I can't do too much. My phone is kind of dying. Okay, let's do this again. So, he's not as hard of a boss as you may think. Just know the pattern, you'll be fine. First part is parryable. I do have a debuffer and a barrier, but I'm going to try and not use my barrier. You don't really need a barrier character. Recognize the moves. This one, he goes back. Here we go. Easy games. Very easy. Okay. Then next, he always does that. Then he parries after. So, be prepared. Boom. Okay. Then, he would do random stuff. Stuff that would make you hate him. Because I already hate him. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to miss that. <laughs> Okay. Boop, 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 and he does that again. Harry, and I might be able to kill him. Okay, there we go. 42 seconds. That's how I did part one. So, maybe if I had the equipment and all, I could have gone lower. Who knows? Maybe there's other ways I could have actually beaten him. But, as far as I'm concerned, that's the best I can do. Okay, anyways, let's, let's keep going. Let's keep going. So, 5600. I wonder if I can improve my score. You know? I don't even remember where my original score, so... Yeah, as you can see, I haven't even grinded <laughs> this quest. So you can already tell that I haven't really uh, started learning the boss as much uh, yet. Anyways, let's go. So, two stunners at least, and a win character, because, you know, this is good for win characters. Now, if you actually have the banner characters, it will be very helpful. So let's see if I can actually do this. So I believe it's at least four SS3s with a stunner until he's actually stunned. Now, if you don't know what I mean, here I go. So this is one SS3 with a stunner. Yuki's my other one. That's two. Then he backs up. And he falls fast parry. This is my third. And this is the fourth. Now, he should be stunned. Game back some MP. Use my other character to do some damage. Here we go. Let's do another one. One. I'm not gonna spam here. Here we go. Two. Try and get some more MP there. Okay. I believe that was two. Oh god. Problem is, I ran out of SS3s. So, I have to improvise. There we go. <laughs> 52 seconds, that was terrible. I had 48 before. So, yeah, I was kind of off. But hey, that's at least an idea for you guys. If you haven't seen other people's videos of how to beat this boss, I'm pretty sure by now you have. But for those that haven't, oh, 10%. <laughs> for those of you that haven't, I somehow got a new score. Nice. <laughs> but for those of you that haven't, then uh there you go just make sure you have two stunners it doesn't matter what element they are but it is better if you have the banner the wind character banner that have stun so you can deal more damage and beat this way faster so yeah good luck on the event guys hopefully you guys do well i should also mention that if you guys actually logged in we actually got a new free character now, if you guys don't know who i'm talking about we actually got this scene on. If you guys remember from my last video, I did show off this scene on. Yes, we did get her. Sadly though, I cannot show her off because I don't have the experience points. So I'll have to show her off another time. But 
Anyways, everybody, I want to thank you all for watching this video of Sword Art Online Memory Deep Frag. If you guys did, don't forget to leave a like to let me know you guys enjoy it and want to see some more. Subscribe to the channel, don't forget to turn on notifications so you guys can miss a video from this channel, as well as join my Discord at the very bottom of the description. Click on the link, keep you right to the Discord. But, anyways, I want to thank you all for watching. My name is Kaz. I hope you have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys all again in the very next video. And again, thank you all so, so much. For 20,000 subscribers, it really does mean a lot to me, and I never thought I'd hit it. But yeah, thank you all for watching, and goodbye!